Portuguese mum, born in Hong Kong, and my father, Australian, uh, and myself born in Sydney. So grew up in the southern suburb. We moved a lot after losing some money and then decided to be creative. Uh, moved into fashion, and then kind of that's brought me to today. When you're working with a brand like King that's been around for five decades, I think the process is really about breaking it down. First, you have to forget everything that you've, you've seen. You have to stop all the noise. Next, you have to sit back and listen and ask the questions why. You need to be brave to deliver what you do in your own way as an artist. The inspiration behind Something Worth Keeping was initially Australian story. Breaking it down, you know, a deeper kind of seed and inspiration comes from my own personal experience with families because it's a story that connects with us all. Well, the process is, is quite amazing. It starts off quite detailed and very considered. Uh, with this really simple idea. Then from there you, you storyboard that process uh, and it keeps building and getting bigger and bigger until it gets to a point where it's so big you almost, you know, just let those moments unfold. Like I say, for us it was cueing some of the moments of how that feels. You know, you, you need the feeling to be able to tell the story and see how the, and see how the product functions. So this, this, you've got this great design and functionality and then how that lives in a real setting, how that circle of life happens each and every day is, is the great design. You put that together and if that works well, then you've got something worth keeping. When I do what I do, it's about, okay, how, does, how do I connect you into being really authentic and honest? Jasper makes it easier to function because it's, you know, you can do so many things. So the puppet show was a great example of bringing that sort of, you know, some, some of those things to life. You can remove a pillow, reconfigure your Jasper and create a little setting that the kids can potentially do a puppet show. So that was some of the thinking behind that. So it was pretty, it was, it was quite easy. All you had to do was like literally, okay, take the understanding of how that functions and mix it in with real life scenarios, allow me to sort of write some of those um, moments in that cue people and hopefully we connect with it.